The answer to healthcare in America is the only answer that ever exists when you want to lower cost and improve quality. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm going to give you an example that sounds a little far afield, but I think it'll make the point. Do you remember when plasma TVs first came out? Remember how expensive they were? I think they were fifteen to twenty thousand dollars a TV, depending on the size of the TV that you wanted. Plasma TVs now range from two to four thousand dollars a TV. And that's a dramatic decrease in price. Plasma TVs today are better than the plasma TVs that cost three and four and five times more. So we've had a dramatic decrease in price and a reasonable increase in quality. How did that happen? Did it happen because government came along and mandated that you have to have a plasma TV? <laughs> did, it, did it come along because government not only mandated it, but then gave you the money to buy the plasma <laughs> TV? If government did both of those things, the cost of plasma TVs would have gone up two or three times. And the quality of plasma TVs would have declined because there'd be no reason to improve the quality. In fact, there might not be much of a motive to do anything but to make them on the cheap because you knew you had to sell them. But do you realize that's what our healthcare system is? That's the healthcare system that you and I now have in large measure. We have a healthcare system dominated by government, large employers, and HMOs. There is nothing in it that moves dramatically toward lowering costs and improving quality. It's an entitlement program. It is not an insurance program. Your auto insurance is insurance. Your health insurance is an entitlement program. Your auto insurance, you, you, you decide how much auto insurance you want to pay for. And you have a deductible. And you, you cover out of your own pocket the ordinary expenses you're going to have with your automobile. You don't cover uh, oil changes and tire changes and car washes on your insurance. You pay that out of your pocket. Because you figure, you figure out what you can afford, and then you cover the part that would hurt you. And then we all have different deductibles, and we make different deals, and there are different insurance products, and some people want small deductibles, some people want large deductibles. Uh, they create a tremendous market, so they create a lot of different products. And that's, that's where we have to go with covering more people on health insurance.